Hey everybody. Happy, happy uh, Thursday. Hope all is well with everybody. Um, just doing some cooking here. I'm getting um, some macaronis for myself. I purchased um, Barilla, Barilla, um, whole grain elbows. So I'm gonna be having these along with some leftover pasta uh, gravy that I have, which yes, they're in my frozen bowls. <laughs> I, uh, these are actually Ziploc bowls that I purchased quite a few years ago. Um, yeah, no, not too bad. Went to Dollar Tree today. Didn't, <coughs> excuse me, didn't get too much stuff. But what I did get, tissues, napkins, blah, 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 things like that. I did uh, get one of these, and I'm kind of stumped, but I, I don't even know. I'm, I really don't want to put holes in my wall. So maybe I can actually use some uh, command strips. That's what I think I'm gonna do. To, it is called a garden tool hanger, but I guess you can use this for mops, brooms, things like that. You know, it has like the rollers and you just, you know, put it on, just it hangs. I guess it's pretty good. I saw these from another, um, I seen these from another Dollar Tree video. Now, all the Dollar Tree videos that I see, of course, they are stocked. They are stocked. My Dollar Trees today, they usually get their shipments in on Thursday. So that's exactly what they were doing. They really didn't have much. And I only got one of these because this was flung in an aisle in a shelf that I was getting my table napkins. I buy these table napkins. I bought two of these. There were 150 table napkins. I just need napkins for the table during dinner. This was shoved in the shelf. So if I wasn't looking for these, I would have never found this. So I only got one and I didn't see anything anywhere else. So. Now, yesterday, was it yesterday? No, it was Tuesday. And I met my husband for dinner at uh, Applebee's. I did, lo and behold, pick up the other matching bag to the set of the little crossbody bag that I had shown you. And this is the Walt Disney 100 Years. The Walt Disney 100 Years bag. This is uh, this bag is on a little bit of a bigger style, and that's fine. So it also says here the 100 Years. Lovely picture. Front pocket. Ears on the back. Backpack on the back. Let's see what's on the inside of the bag. Huge, 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 huge front pocket. Huge. Huge, deep front pocket. I mean, you can fit two hands in here. That's how big this is. It is a huge front pocket. Very cool. Um, what's on the inside? I didn't even take a look yet. This bag went for $20. Okay, there is a zipper in the front. It also gives you, and I know you really can't see it, it gives you the... You know what? I'm just going to take this out. It gives you the 100th anniversary tag. It's on the inside of the bag as well, as opposed to this nice tag. I mean, they have a lot of cute stuff for the 100th anniversary of Walt Disney. They really do. So I'm going to just shove this back in here. Um, I did, however, I guess you guys had seen it on my Instagram post that I did get my shelves. My shelves last night, I put them up. My husband went to work um, late last night and I took the liberty of saying, you know what, I'm not tired and I still have some energy and what I wanna do is put my shelves together. So I sat here in the living room and I put the shelves together. So also what I wanna show you is not only did I pick up this bag, and I love the M's that are on it. You've seen that from the smaller bag that I got. So I'm glad I got this. I also picked up the sneakers that I had wanted. They finally had a size eight. They only had two pairs left, this and the other pair. 
So these are my sneakers in a size eight. If you notice here on the sides, they have a little sparkle to them. They are really cute. Really, really, really cute. Very, very neat and very stylish. They really don't have nothing on the other sides, just the little sparkles and you can see that. Love it. And these sneakers went for $20 as well. And that's fine. Like I said last week, I was I was doing well because I hit $200 on a $20 scratch off last week. So I'm still working on that. And that's how I got my shelves. And that's how I got these things. And then last week when I went to the concert, I, I spent, you know, some other money on that. And it all worked out well. So you know what? Let me show you what I did with my shelves. Let me show you here. Hopefully I can put my hand here. It's not really bad. Um, I, I, you know, when you accumulate the bags, you do have a lot more bags than what you would like to. And this is what the shelves look like. Let's step back just a little bit so I can show you. I think I could show you. Now I did what it, what I did was I went for the five row shelving instead of the four row shelving. Now the four row shelving is the ones that you see in my kitchen. That's the four row. Um, I didn't want them in chrome. I did get I did get the black ones, and this is what it looks like. I think I did very well. What I did also over here was to use the hooks that I had purchased. So let's just take this one down here and let me show you what's on the inside. I do have rows and rows of other bags. And I'm sorry for that this house is not well lit a little bit more. Let me see what I can do here as far as ouch, opening. Ah, oh, what did I do? I closed it. Opening and letting some light in. So now you can see the shelves. And I think I did well. Now on the bottom here, and I know you can't see this because it's darkness in here. And the bottom here is when I have the stackable drawers. I did get those. I only got two of those. Um, this row here is all my Bath and Body Works products. I had to continue the Bath and Body Works on this side because I was running out of slight room. Now this is a 30, uh, 34 across. This is a 34 across. Now, what I did was originally, I was supposed to go for the 14 uh, depth. And instead, I wound up going for the 16 in depth. And that's okay because, you know, I do have rows of bags. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you this. If I can, you will see the other bags. And I do have bags that are hanging up. This one right here is hanging. There's three of them hanging in the back. One, two, and three. So I got, I actually got four in the front here, which I think is pretty cool. And um, that's really it. So I want to say, all in all, the shelves are okay. I'm happy with them. I, mean, I could just put that one right back up here. I'm happy with it all in all. And that's what it looks like. Now, the top row, I really, 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 really did not want to put any more lounge flies on the top row. But, of course, I'm probably going to have to. And I didn't want to do that. But in case it happens, I know at least I am confident enough to have another row. What am I going to do? And that's what the shelving looks like. Now, next to here, I do have my original little Sterilite. This is the smaller version Sterilite. I was going to actually get rid of it, but for now, I think I'm gonna keep it because that's where all my paperwork is going to be. I do have some drawers here to go through. I have to go through that, personal important papers. I think I'm just gonna use that Sterilite for um, uh, important like filing papers and stuff for now. Because what I want to do is to dispose of that Sterilite. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Yeah, let's, let's see if I can do this here. I want to expose, uh, um, uh, dispose of that Sterilite and possibly get something in black. I know they have them in black. My husband originally did have one in black. 
we left it and I think we got rid of it when we relocated and I kept the white one for some crazy reason. I think I should have kept his. See, see what happens. So everything changes. Um, but that would, that's really it. Um, today happens to be a, a somber day for me. Um, my, today is the anniversary of my mother-in-law's passing. Uh, it is five years today and it's just, you know, think of these things and I really don't know what else to uh, to say about that. I'm I'm not taking it uh, very well, you know. I I was her caretaker, um, for um, to take care of her as as she was getting sicker and sicker. So um, yeah, it's not a not a very uh, peppy day, and I I apologize for that. But um, I do I I do plan on maybe going to Primark tomorrow. I don't know why. I don't know. Blech. I just don't know what I'm doing right now. So at least the shelves are done. Um, I hope you could get to see them as best you can because it, the lighting in there right now sucks. Um, so anyway, that's really it. I'm going to continue here. I'm going to have my macaronis for dinner. And I hope everyone is having a, a, a very nice uh, Thursday. It didn't rain. It rained, I think, for maybe 10 minutes, but it stayed cloudy for the whole day. Now, tomorrow's supposed to be sunny. We are in the 50s as far as degrees are concerned. So, yeah. So, anyway, I'm nursing my boiler. My boiler is waiting for a circuit board part, a whole circuit control panel. We're not happy about this, but I guess it needs to be done because the um, backfiring was still happening and my husband is livid. My husband says, you know, they, they get this part, this better, this better work. I mean, what else, what else can we do? You know, but, uh, we go after it, we fix things. So, but uh, it's just a shame. These things happen. All right, people. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. And I hope all is well for everybody. Take care. Have a good rest of the evening, Thursday evening. God bless you. Love to all. Take care. Have a good night. Bye-bye.